I worked in urban search and rescue years ago. I worked on robots for urban search and rescue, and that's a challenge because you're in a, in a situation where there's rubble, you don't necessarily have flat floor anymore, and people risk their lives to go to those spaces. The person who wrote the contestant entry for the uh, fire truck entry, they knew their stuff. They talked about the problems that real firefighters face, and that excited me. This idea that, you know, we have technology that can actually image a fire at the other end, at the business end of the ladder, and keep the firefighters away from the business end while you steer it to exactly the right place. We also have technologies for proximity, for detecting how far away the tip of the ladder is from a window or from a brick wall. And so you could even imagine one day going farther into the future, automatic means, where you look at a picture of the building, the firefighter clicks on a screen somewhere, and the ladder swivels and goes there and stays there and does station keeping, just the same way you might hover a helicopter exactly in one spot. So that project to me was really exciting because today's technology, if you just add it to today's fire truck, right away it gives you more functionality and it does it in a more safe way for the firefighter.